Indiana Attorney General Curtis Hill tonight is facing a disciplinary complaint from the state Supreme Court Disciplinary Commission. Four women, including State Representative Mara Candelaria Reardon, accused the Attorney General of sexually harassing and groping them during a party last March. The complaint alleges that Curtis Hill engaged in a pattern of misconduct and committed criminal acts, each of which reflects adversely on his honesty, trustworthiness, or fitness as a lawyer. A special prosecutor declined to file charges last year, saying he believed that Hill's accusers but didn't have enough evidence for the criminal charges to be filed. An inspector general report came to a similar conclusion regarding ethics violations. The attorney general has 30 days to respond. Governor Eric Holcomb briefly addressed that complaint today. Uh, I haven't read it. I heard uh, the news broke, and you know I haven't changed my opinion since I originally spoke on the issue. Governor Holcomb has previously called for the attorney general to resign. Hill's attorney released this response today, saying this matter will be addressed through the proper process outlined for disciplinary complaints in the state of Indiana. We are confident it will conclude in a manner consistent with the results of the prior investigations.